So we've all been there, laying in bed, trying to fall asleep, and then that familiar ping, a text message, an email comes in, and you just have to read it. Your addiction to your phone may have a scary side effect that you might not remember in the morning. You've heard of sleepwalking and sleep eating, but now there's a new phenomenon affecting people all over the globe. It's called sleep texting. Dr. Michael Gelb of the Gelb Sleep Center in Manhattan studies sleep disorders and has treated patients for decades. Kids and a lot of adults have iPhones, Androids, and they always have the phone. As a matter of fact, you feel the buzzing in your pocket. Even though there's no phone there, you just sense that there's something, a sound going off because we're so attached to our phones that the line is blurred between wakefulness and sleep. The disorder is most prevalent with people using a sleep medication like Ambien. It happened to actress Kristen Chenoweth, as she told Ellen DeGeneres. I had a bad experience. I, I'm sure, as we all know, Haiti was a devastating, devastating thing to see. And I was watching it one, one night on Ambien, and then I tweeted that I was going to adopt a, a baby from Haiti. We're in those early stages of sleep. When we get awoken, we're not fully awake. So we're in this halfway point between, it's like a half half asleep, half awake, we're answering text in our sleep, and the next morning we're not really, we don't remember doing it. So what can you do to prevent yourself from sleep texting? There's one easy solution. Power the phone down, put it in a charger, but do it outside your room. Don't make it, don't fall asleep with the phone in your hand. You've gotta be in a silent room, a cool room, and a dark room. Sleep texting. Have you ever even, no, right? Not even close. I mean, I know with Ambien, people do some now and then. They, you know, there's been reports of people getting in cars, all kinds so of crazy things. So my question things. is, is the deal that you're on Ambien and you're doing crazy things like texting, or are you really I, a, like a person not on Ambien can also it, do this? I think, yeah, I mean, sleepwalkers who just, just plain sleepwalk, there are people out there are that you, do it. Have you ever done anything crazy no. in your sleep? Not like that. I mean, Me I, I've kicked and, you know, maybe sure. gotten physical during dreams and stuff, but nothing Aside like that. Aside from maybe mumbling some incoherent nonsense, But I got right? an excuse. If I ever do a drunk text, I would, no, no, no. I was, <laughs> I was sleep texting. <laughs> right. It's sleep texting. <laughs> it's a new thing. Yes, exactly right. <laughs> All right. Well, that brings us to our Facebook question of the day. We want to know, what is the weirdest thing you've ever done while sleeping? Keep it clean, folks. Please. Share your story. Log on to WNNFans.com. That could get out of control. The weirdest <laughs> thing ever. The you weirdest don't thing know. ever. Yeah. <laughs> Let's keep it PG.